Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to get images in your Google Bard responses. So one of the advantages or benefits of using Google Bard is that you can also include images in your Google Bard responses. So as you can see here in this example, I asked uh, Google Bard to give me a history of Bitcoin USD price and include price charts as well. And this is what Google Bard has done. So as you can see, it will include a complete Bitcoin USD price chart and you can click on it and check out the full picture. And there is a lot of chart for all the Bitcoin years. So as you can see, we have Bitcoin price chart for 2011, 13, 17, 18, 21, and for all years basically. So if you want to also get images in your Google Bard responses, the only thing you have to do is basically tell Google Bard because it understands natural language to include images in its response. So in this example, I asked specifically for price charts, but let's see another example. So let's say we want to learn more about the New York Stock Exchange. So, so let's say we want to learn more about some things about the New York Stock Exchange. And besides adding this prompt, I also explicitly tell Google Bard to include images about the New York Stock Exchange. And if we execute this prompt, you will see that Google Bard will also include images in its response. So we have to wait a couple of seconds. And as you can see, here we get an overview of, of the New York Stock Exchange. And we also get an image of the New York Stock Exchange from Wikipedia. So all in all, this is how to get images, charts, diagrams, and other visual media in your Google Bard responses.